Valentine's Day forecast. Hi, Brian. Good morning to you, Julia. Good morning to everybody out there right now. I have a 15 minute time lapse. This is looking from Bear Mountain in Shasta County. Notice all the clouds out there. That's a different picture that we haven't been seeing lately. We haven't seen many clouds in probably almost a week, but we are seeing plenty of clouds this morning across the area. But some areas are seeing clearer skies at the moment. Temperatures in Redding, 37 degrees right now, 39 in Red Bluff, also 30s in the West Valley. And as we look to Butte County, sitting in the low 40s at the moment, 20s in the Sierra at the moment, 36 though if you are in Susanville, and then mainly 20s, although a few 30s as you head towards the coast in Trinity and Siskiyou County. Now, as we take a look at those highs that we're going to be seeing today, we will be warming into the upper 60s for many of you, some of you just the mid-60s, and then those mountain locations looking like mid-50s, maybe some 60s. Alturas could only reach 48, though, so that's going to be pretty cold. And then 50s as you go out towards the coast. But we do have this high pressure sitting off the coast, and yes, he is still there. He's been there for weeks, and he's not going anywhere. Unfortunately, he's going to be there for quite a while for the next few weeks and he's going to be keeping us dry probably through late November. But today, guys, be happy. It's Valentine's Day. So let's take a look at that Valentine forecast for your Valentine's date. Looking like 66 degrees as we go into the afternoon. Mostly sunny skies and the wind speeds aren't going to be too bad. Could get a little breezy in the afternoon, but it's not going to be too terrible. As for a look at that seven day forecast, look at that 66 today and tomorrow and on Sunday. And then once we go to Monday, we drop to 64, but still we do get some extra clouds on the weekend. And then once we go to Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, looking pretty windy as well. We could have those windy conditions lasting all the way through Thursday, uh, but we will have to wait and see just how strong those winds could get because they could cause some wind advisories to be issued. As for Redding, a high of 67 today, 65 as we go through the weekend. It's 20% chance of getting a slight sprinkle, but otherwise staying completely dry on Sunday. Once we go to Monday and Tuesday, we're getting pretty windy and the sunshine returns, but the highs get back in the upper 60s by Wednesday. Julia, back to you. A million dollar project aimed to bring clean transportation to one Northern California city. Now, city representatives are looking for a way to pay for it. Almost half of Americans admit to cheating.